Finally, like really, really hot here. Oh, oh no. I just got my tinted serum all over my blue shirt. Hello guys. In this video, we're getting my shit together. As you can see, I'm working out outside. Just went on a run. Today was cardio and core. It was like more conditioning. I'm probably gonna do this tomorrow for Full Body Friday. Since spring is already officially among us, we're gonna do some spring cleaning chores. I ran out of water, so I'm gonna finish this last workout. I'm gonna go back home again, hydrate myself. And then we're going to Trader Joe's for the first time in a while. We haven't gone there in a bit because I've been shopping at Aldi's to get all my small cheaper things. I'm definitely getting a tan this is so sunny and humid and hot at the same time there's nothing better than a sunday reset but there's nothing even better than a spring reset it's just like the new coming of a new season and storing away the previous season is so good like mentally and physically and just like environmentally like your environment feeling like that type of rotation and routine that also helps you mentally I'm not even exaggerating. It is so hot today. Usually just like nice and sunny and breezy, but the sun is killer. I'm definitely getting a tan now. I'm not gonna shower. Probably gonna like take a towel and like washcloth myself a little bit just cause we're going to the grocery store. And I'll just shower after because I'll be outside. I've got to shower all of it all. Dang. Okay, 
life. I straightened my hair a couple days ago and you guys know I barely straighten my hair because I don't want to keep putting heat on my hair too much and two because it's a long process so I haven't washed my hair since I straightened it and it's doing well so far. It's not oily. It's not too dried up. It still has texture. That's just how my hair is. Probably gonna try the Heritage Dry Shampoo. It soaks up oils to refresh hair in between washes so and also it will make me smell a lot less like outside Y'all notice my nails that they match in the bottle. I got my nails done yesterday and I got them in like in a nice soft flower spring yellow. They're perfect for my skin tone. So let's try to not kill everyone with our rake at Trader Joe's. That looks so <laughs> I look like Wendy. Babe, look at this. I have a cute little pony. It makes me look like I cut my hair actually. Are we liking the outfit? I know for a fact that it's very revealed, not revealing. It's a very standout outfit with all this blue because when I was going on a run, I had the craziest looks. I'm like wearing full on blue, so I'm like a highlighter. This is my last jar of my green juice, so I'm pretty sure. Looks like she's gotta be rejuiced. I have to remember to get a pineapple, celery, cucumber, like all the things I need for my juices. Like, what else? Apple. Oh, green apples. Next thing that I gotta put on my list is juice, new green juice. Right, I'm taking this to go. I'm adding some kombucha. This is the health aid, I believe. I love this kombucha. If you wouldn't want sugar in your kombucha, what, what does it have? Total 14 grams of sugar. If you don't want that much sugar in your kombucha, then I don't suggest this one to you. This one, I just like. I just did this layer and I look you don't want to like mess it up. I was gonna put the super greens in the green juice. I didn't know this was gonna be this color so now I'm gonna put the powder in water and just layer it back on top. Science y'all. Wasn't it the heavier density or whatever heavier mass um, liquid close to the top? Am I- do I sound stupid? More dense. Dense. So there's density. Okay I knew I was speaking some smartable stuff. I'm guessing this might be thicker because it's not powder. This looks so pretty though. I don't want to mess it up. I'm gonna pour it on. Did I mess it up? No, I'm gonna mess it up. Damn. Well, the more you learn. What is it? What's the saying? You laugh, you lose. You laugh, you lose. Is that what I've it's never called? Heard that Wait, what is the saying? You lose some, you win some. Oh. <laughs> well, that's not what I said. It's not hot, but I put these things so that I'm not touching the cold as cup. Oh yeah, there you go. Got my little trinkety drink. We're going grocery shopping. We made it to Costco first. Do we need garlic? Uh, I don't know, I don't remember. I want to get two of so bad, but they are toxic to cats. Like, look how pretty these are. I've never seen this popcorn before. It says seasoned with nutritional yeast, onion, sea salt, and garlic. This looks really good. The bags look good. I'm debating if I want to get this. It looks really good. I don't know. It, how much is it? Got some non toxic flowers. Not a lot, actually. I don't think I have a vase for these at all, but I'm gonna take a shower first and then I'm gonna rearrange these and put away my groceries. I really do need to take a shower. Like, I'm sweating, stink like funk, so I need to do the courtesy and shower real quick.
so I'm starving. I'm gonna make myself a quick little lunch. I got these burgers from Costco and I really wanna try them. I got them solely because I wanted to make a burger for lunch. The process of flattening out the meat, I didn't wanna do, so I just got pre-made. This is how she looks. We're gonna pop her in the air fryer. I'm gonna use these sandwich skinnies that I got at Aldi's a while ago. They're really good. I had them a couple days ago to make like a little tomato, onion, like mini pizzas. And they're really good. They're literally multi grain, flat. It'll be perfect for this burger. You just go toast them up real quick. While the burger is air frying, I'm gonna figure out where I'm gonna put these flowers. I got a lot and. I keep forgetting I do not have like a big vase for like watered plants. I have it mainly for fake plants. This is the only huge like vase I have and I've only ever used it for like dry things. Yeah, yeah. Oh! I wish it was a wider like vase. Yeah, I like it. Now this is supposed to be a bottle for like wine that I got at Ikea, but I guess we're gonna use it for a base. The only thing I got so far. Today's drink of the day, Olipop sent me a bunch of their classic sodas and today we're having classic little root beer. This one is so fire. I love a good root beer soda in any brand. Oh, I just hits the spot. Eat this burger, we're gonna put my hair up. Right, let's test this bad boy. Mm-hmm, I can taste that fish. I start juicing, which is pretty late for me to start juicing at this time. I normally never juice around like late, but I'm running late for today's video. So it's gonna be a two part video. It's gonna be like a restocking for today and then like more cleaning tomorrow. But Matt's preparing dinner. He's making a rice stir fry with peppers, zucchini, and broccoli. So right now I got a bunch of poppy sodas that I haven't put in the fridge. So I just reorganized it. So we're gonna restock the mini fridge. their little playpen. Put a little catnip all over their toys, so they're about to start playing in this. I've made a little fort for them so that they can have this one corner to themselves. what I did with the orange peels that I put in the oven for a couple of hours on very low heat. Once it cooled down, I put it in the blender and made this vitamin C powder. I basically put this in like my smoothies or my morning drinks with my juices. But yeah, that's what I did. And put it in a jar, tight, tightly sealed. And that's what I did with the leftover orange peels. Thank you. 
got all the leftover pulp in the Ziploc. Since I'm baking the orange peels, I'm gonna bake these tomorrow instead. Cooking over here, I have the homemade teriyaki sauce boiling to get a little thicker. We have shrimp, broccoli, zucchini, carrots, peppers, white rice, and green onions, and a little bit of lettuce. And then we're gonna top it off with some everything bagel seasoning. And I still have my classic root beer from lunch. Lunch was not that long ago, so I don't know what I'm saying. We did get home late. Now we're gonna mix it up with the sauce and start serving ourselves. This looks so good. Good job, babe. It's just a bunch of veggies and shrimp and sauce, so I feel like this is a very healthy version of takeout. I'm not gonna lie, I think I serve myself way too much than I normally eat, but I'll save some as much as I can. We already juiced everything. You already juiced everything. Oh, I already juiced everything. Matt's trying not to take any credit. And then Matt cooked dinner. We both washed the dishes and cleaned everything up, all the juicing stuff, and I put away all the ju juice juices. <sighs> and I am hot, I am tired. I'm eating my dinner and then I'm heading straight to bed. Yeah, this is a lot. I added way too much. I cannot believe I live in a world where Mel, me, is having all these veggies and actually liking it in my dinner. I used to be such a huge picky eater. Good morning, we're up bright and early on a Friday. Literally woke up to these flowers on my counter and I'm so obsessed, like I miss having fresh flowers all up in my house. The one behind me, I love the idea of splashing a bit of color onto this white wall because I really don't have color here. I'm at, trying to add color into my hospital looking at his apartment. Before I went ahead and did my full body workout, I'm cleaning up around the house to get that started, trying to catch up on what I was gonna do yesterday. I obviously started on putting away the dishes. Now I'm cleaning up these floors because when I tell you guys, when we were juicing and cooking and running around putting the groceries away yesterday, the floor got sticky and dirty in the matter of time. So we're doing a good deep clean around here. Also, this is not a vape. I'm explaining Ripple to you for a quick second. So Ripple is an organic aroma diffuser with zero nicotine and a thousand puffs. It has like a bunch of flavors. It's meant to boost your energy. It's meant to make you feel happy, make you feel focused. And it's all different flavors. Like this one I think is a passion fruit and they taste so good. Like I know a lot of people have a problem when it comes to vaping or smoking and they're trying to quit cold turkey and it's not that easy so if you're trying to look for an alternative to try to help you not go full cold turkey and something minor enough to help you get out of that habit it ripple will definitely be your go-to again there's like no nicotine there's no drugs in here it's just a flavor to roll with diffuser for the thousand plus when i tell you i don't have a smoking problem or a substance problem i just have like the uh, i think it's called oral fixation which which basically, I don't have the problem of wanting to feel high. I don't like the feeling of feeling buzzed. That's not what I'm obsessed with. I just like the fixation of inhaling something and blowing it out. Literally, when I had my asthma pump as a kid or like my oil diffuser, I would put it in my mouth and like try to make rings or something. This I take on a daily. Let me know in the comments if you guys are willing to try this or have tried this or you want to try it. What you think about it and all that, I'll leave all the information in the description for you guys if you want to check them out. 
but I'm pretty sure she is focused. This one is uh, the focused one, so definitely using this right now so I can not procrastinate on cleaning. Right now, I already finished up the vacuuming and we're getting started on the mopping. If you guys wanna know what's in my, my mop like liquid, I have like 20 pumps of white wine vinegar, boiling water, and a small cap full of fabuloso, so. start heading out to work out. I am having my Alani new mimosa pre-workout. I didn't wear this yesterday for my cardio and core workout, but I'm gonna put on some sunscreen because I keep forgetting that putting sunscreen on my face is great, you know, but not putting it on my body. I keep forgetting. I get dark so quickly. If I feel like the camera isn't doing me justice, but why is there a tissue in me? Oh, it's my allergy tissue, sorry. If y'all saw me in real life, this is not as dark as I look. Like when I'm near like white things, like white camera. I don't know. I feel like to me, I look like so much darker than the camera. It's so weird. Like that's completely different. <laughs> I never got sunburned in my life, but I don't not I don't do this because I don't want to get sunburned. I don't want to be affected by the sun because it is dangerous. I'm pretty sure having no sunscreen daily will cause like skin cancer or something or just permanent damages and I don't want to do that. I want to avoid that. I avoid putting on sunscreen a lot like a body sunscreen just because I'm so used to the oily sunscreens that I spray on when I'm at the beach or pool. But I completely forgot there's like moisturizing ones that this one's for sport too. It's from Walgreens. It's huge. I keep forgetting that there's sunscreens that are like lotion like mineral lotion so I think I'm going to be putting this on more often. It smells pretty good. It smells like perfume. I'm going to put this all over my body especially my back. My back is always out in the open when I'm working out, so I'm gonna have Matt put that on me because I don't know how to get back there. Got a pre-workout and our sunscreen. That means it's time to go work out outside. Yesterday was just cardio and core. Today we had to use all my body muscles and I am feeling it. I am definitely gonna be much darker than I was yesterday. So let's get home and finish up the rest of this spring reset. I already showered and ate some lunch. All I gotta do is clean up a little bit. And once I'm done, ooh, it smells like, oh, uh, is this like orange? Clementine scent, oh, that's fire. It smells literally like an orange. All I gotta do is clean up around the house a little bit, organize before I continue any cleaning. Let's do our skincare for today. I already put on my SPF moisturizer this morning, but I did not put any of my serums, any of my toners, just cut. I sweated all off my sunscreen from my face, so we're just not gonna waste all that skincare. Let me wash my hands. I have false lotion on me. Put my headband on. Oh man, I'm out of my vitamin C. This one's the glow drops from Typology. I don't think I ever tried this on camera. It's such a glowy shot. Like, look at that. It's like glistening, shiny drops. They really do make my face look and feel glowy as hell. Before I do any of my tinted skincare, I'm gonna lay these brows real quick. And we're back. I also laid my lashes too. Let me know if you guys really like these nails on me, like putting them against my face while I do this is so bright. Now let's get started on cleaning. What should we start with? Hmm, I feel like we should start with the kitchen, the kitchen counter and the sink real quick.
here she is, a little bar car. She's obviously not or unorganized. I organized her a while ago, so she's pretty. I put the flowers from yesterday there. I was like changing my mind all over the place with all the flowers, so I'm gonna be there just for right now. But all she needs is a good wipe down, so let's dust her up real quick. Currently organizing my under the sink cabinet, so stand by. I impulsively did this out of stimulation, so I'm gonna do a time lapse real quick. our shower curtain liner with a brand new one we just bought that one we tried washing i don't even want to show you guys how dirty it is because the color is like literally a yellow green from top to bottom we literally tried scrubbing it and putting it in the like washing machine like we saw somebody do on tiktok but dude it it does not come out i think we just had a really crappy one so we're gonna replace it right now That is so okay. You guys didn't see me do this, but I reorganized this little drawer. I didn't have my pre-workout or my super greens in here. I just had my tea and my matcha, but I finally switched up this divider container from my other pantry and put it in here. I feel like it's 10 times better to have it here. So just to let y'all know how pretty that is. Guys, don't be surprised. I'm going out. <laughs> don't want me. Let me get on the better mirror over here. I'm going out. It's a Friday night. Okay, that's much better. It was so dark. I had such a productive Friday and Thursday yesterday. So I think it's it's nice to get all cute and dressed up and just go out. I'm only gonna have like a drink or two. That's my limit for today. I'm gonna commit to that because the reset does involve me trying to do a little more better and healthier when it comes to my cocktail. So hopefully I'll just add mo hopefully they have a mocktail. I don't really mind a mocktail. I just want something in my hand and feel and all cute with you know a drink that doesn't have to be alcoholic if y'all like the fit i'm wearing these bell bottoms that are pretty much thrifted this top where did i get this top i think sheen a long time ago right sheen that's basically it then i'm wearing these heels i completely forgot where i got them i think forever 21 and yeah that's tonight's fit i got my rollers in oh, i just wanted to look pretty today i'm gonna head out i don't know if i'm gonna film afterwards that's today's spring reset a reset does not have to be perfect it's all about balance so i do feel like I deserve a good chill night out. I was gonna have a night in and besides Nia's sick So she left me hanging today. I always go out with her But I had a group of friends that invited me out. So I was like, you know what? Why not tomorrow? I'm gonna be doing a little volleyball date with one of my other new friends and like a beach day tomorrow So it's gonna be a good weekend. I want to treat myself as much as I can now. Let me go get my groove on <laughs> 